lives at risk for shutting down its account. The Armour Welfare Trust, based in Bolton's, distributed £70 million to projects in 20 different countries. It's had a presence in Gaza for the past 10 years. But the charity has now received a letter from the HSBC to tell them their account is being closed for being beyond the bank's risk appetite, as they put it. Our correspondent Ashley Derricott has this report. It's aid destined for war zones desperately needed humanitarian supplies. Last year alone, the Bolton-based Umar Welfare Trust distributed over £15 million of relief. Yet their job is about to become more difficult. Thanks to a letter from the bank, the HSBC has just informed this registered charity it no longer wants their business. The reason? It's outside their taste for risk. We are... Uh, a charity which never takes out a loan, we have never had an overdraft, so it doesn't make sense from a business perspective to be closing down an account of a customer who only gives profit to the bank. This is the work the Umar Trust does on the ground in war-ravaged zones of Afghanistan, Syria and Iraq. Yet it's their involvement in Gaza that the volunteers suspect is the reason for being dropped by their bank. The last time it happened was in 2008, at the time of the last major Israeli conflict. Just in this crisis, we have been able to send life-saving equipment to hospitals such as Shifa Hospital. This would not have been possible without the speedy transfers of monies from the banking system in this country. The HSBC has denied responding to pro-Israeli pressure. Discrimination against customers on grounds of race or religion is immoral, unacceptable and illegal, they say. And HSBC has comprehensive rules and policies in place to ensure race and religion are never factors in decisions we make. Here, they say, efforts will go on to get aid to the war zones most needy. Even if it does mean relief is slower getting through. Ashley Derricott, ITV News, Bolton. Next tonight, 